My name is Firas Onyam, I'm a consultant dermatologist with um, a lot of um, interest and passion in lasers and in particular laser resurfacing, a procedure I have performed uh, many of those. Um, laser resurfacing is a method of a controlled injury to uh, the skin, to the surface of the skin, to allow for healing that will result in smoother uh, surface of the skin with less wrinkles and, and lines. Depending on the thickness of the skin, the parameters will have to be adjusted and it is important that one would um, match the expectations of the patient but the key thing is appropriate patient selection. Some patients may not be uh, appropriate for laser resurfacing whereas some others uh, laser re resurfacing would be the most appropriate treatment for the area around the eyes and on the uh, skin on the upper upper lip. Um, so things that I will be looking for is the past medical history, the drug history, the medication that they are currently on, any previous treatments that they had, assess the thickness of the skin, the degree of the lines and wrinkles I will take into consideration, the background um, pigment and we'll discuss with them the treatment options. Often in my practice I uh, combine different treatment modalities because uh, the patients may have volume loss as well, that they would, they would benefit from volume replacement with filler treatment. So a classical example would be treatment with laser resurfacing followed by um, treatments with dermal fillers. With any laser resurfacing treatment, there can be some uh, expected um, side effects that is important to recognize and um, inform the patient about the recovery, and some unusual, unexpected um, complications. Um, now, fortunately, these are uh, uncommon, and with good aftercare and monitoring of the patients, these can be minimized, but they may include uh, infection, hence um, adequate antiseptic uh, anti-infection care is uh, mandatory uh, post-treatment. In some cases there can be some prolonged redness uh, that can vary from person to person and extreme cases scarring but um, in experienced hands that's uh, very rare. 